Hello friends. In this set of videos, we'll be covering up the topic of options algo trading for beginners. So a lot of people told us to create courses around algos that too based on options trading. And uh, Speedbot uh, would be creating such courses from basic to advanced in the near future. And this is one of the courses that uh, currently we have published. So this is an educational initiative by Speedbot. So firstly, this is the course for people who have an option trading strategy with them, who have a basic understanding of okay, how options work and the strategies around them. And they want to translate those trading rules to an automated system. So firstly, let's see what all course objectives that we'll be covering up in this course. Firstly, being an option trader, why do you think there's a need of algo? That is why as an option trader, would you want to switch from manual to algo trading? So we'll be covering this topic uh, in this video. Next up, we'll be helping you out ke how easily and efficiently you'll be able to create your own option trading algo with minimum efforts. Later on, we'll be discussing about what are the most popular types of option trading algos in the market currently and how you can make them. So these option trading algos could range from the intraday based option trading algos from the swing trade or the expiry trading based option trading algos. Later on, we'll be helping you to create your own option trading algo for different market conditions like We'll be creating a option trading algo for a bullish market, for a bearish market, or for a sideways market. Later on comes part of the basic trade adjustment in option trading algos. Let's say ke if you have created an algo trading option strategy and that strategy has been running with some good amount of losses, how can you adjust those losses? so that at least you will be able to come to a break even on that particular option trading algo. So we'll be helping you out with the basic trade adjustments. Next up, we'll be helping you out okay, how efficiently you can create a basket or a portfolio of algo trading options bot so that when there is a downfall in the market or there is a position against you multiple sets of strategy would help you to minimize the tent in your overall strategy wise profit and loss so we'll be covering that part as well in this later video so firstly let's understand k how a manual trader executes a trade so when i talk about the manual trader assume that the manual trader already has an option trading strategy with them it could be a call buy it could be a put sell right so let's assume that the manual trader is trading in options and how he currently executes the trade so let's have a look at that so firstly in order to execute the trade he or she needs to calculate some of the things that we'll be seeing and once he or she calculates the things manually then they will execute the trade pretty manually right so that's how a manual trader executes a trade. So let's look at what all things, what all things that the manual trader calculates. Firstly, that is the strike price selection, right? So the strike price selection is selected by the trader in such a way that based on his option trading strategy, he or she will choose the strike price. It could be based on the current market price. It could be five strikes or six strikes away from the market price right so this is a selection that is manual later on he or she will execute that particular strike price of the option contract right so once that entry order is filled the next step that the manual trader has to do is he or she will calculate the target as well as the stop loss for this particular entry order so this is something also that needs to be done manually fourth step is the target and stop loss order will be placed so once the calculation of the target and stop loss is done then it is the manual trader's responsibility to place the 
target as well as the stop loss orders in the terminal or the broker account once that is done he has to check whether the target or the stop loss orders are hit let's say ki if the position is going against the trader then it is but obvious that the stop loss order will get hit in that case the target order will remain open and it is the manual labor that the trader has to bear in order to cancel the pending order else a reverse position would have been created and there are chances that the damages would have been more so this is how a manual trader calculates all the things over here and then he has to look for the execution so what do you think that the smart trader does so we are differentiating how a manual trader trades and how a smart trader executes a trade so now let's see what all things that a smart trader does firstly the calculations are automated and once the calculations are done then the execution of such things are executed automatically right so firstly the thing that the manual trader did was to select the strike price manually which in our case in the automated calculation is done through the algo and once that is done then the entry order is filled automatically later on the algo places sorry the algo calculates the target as well as the stop loss later on the automated target and stop loss orders are done placed then the algo consistently checks it continuously checks in second by second whether the current price current market price has reached the stop loss order or the target and let's assume the previous scenario okay the stop loss order gets hit or gets triggered then instead of having the reverse entry open of the target order the automated order for the target which was placed earlier will be cancelled automatically right so this is how the algo efficiently trades so now you will be able to see a difference ki how a smart trader executes a trade versus how a manual trader executes a trade right so now the question is how to be a smart trader in order to be a smart trader firstly i mean if you have the trading rules then i mean the 33% of the work is done right so you have to have your option trading strategy with you that is the trading rules now what's next the automated calculation you need not worry about the calculations you will have to just input the calculations the algo will take care of all the calculations after that the automated execution the automated execution based on the calculations that the algo has done so let the bot do the things for you so combining all these three things where do you get all these three things it comes with the speedbot option builder so this is where we'll be creating all our strategies in the option bot builder and in a no code way that too so in the later part of this course we'll be covering in detail ke how you can create your own strategy based on different market conditions how you can create a more efficient portfolio which is pretty effective when the things go down south or things go against your positions right so we'll be covering a lot in the later part of this course thanks for watching this video Thank you.